Hello people, so we will create our first page. So before I start, let me tell you that Symfony work with the MVC approach, that is a model view and control um, approach. So for control, we have here in our project folder controller. So this controller contains of different files such as JSON, HTML, JavaScript, XML, every other file as possible. So um, we need to model this in the controller to get a proper output. So that's why it's being called as a model view controller approach. So let's start with editing the controller here. So I'm going to create a new file, a PHP file, and name it as app. Controller.php. So let's start with the namespace app. Controller. And let's use a HTTP response because we are using the HTML page to see our first page. So we're using HTML. So let's use a HTML response. So I will use Symphony. Component HTTP Foundation Response and I want to use a notation. So notation is nothing but roots. So if you want to create a web page with a page name. You need a root for it. So, to include a notation in your project, just type um, Composer require annotations, and then you will have an access to this. Use simply component. Routing annotation and rot. Now, as we are using annotation as a service, so we want to say we are using some services, so you need to include a um, bundle which can give you that service. So, Symphony Bundle Framework Bundle Controller abs Abstract Controller So we are set with using these important bundles. Now let's create a rod here. Rod. So rod is always started with R or UTE. And double quotations. Um, let's say home, okay, home would be the main name of the page and let's create a function 
I think I need to create a class first. So class controller name, which is app controller extends abstract controller. Now I want to create a function properly function and the function name let's say hello or home and written this we want to render a HTML page so where we can find this HTML page so let us create a new HTML page for that I need to install Twig so you can see a command in any of the browser how to install Twig so once you have done installing Twig just create you will get to um, see a templates folder so I don't have any files, not too many files in template folder. So let me just create a new folder quick. So that is home.html.twig. These files always end up with .twig. So let me create a title. First home page. And the heading. So this is my first page. Okay, save this. And here you need to specify the template home.html. But let me just delete this. Oh, home.html is already there. I would like to create a new folder. Okay, so I, I'm just going to write it down straight in the templates. And home. Oh, it's like, oh, oh, you don't need to write any templates. Just straight away write home.html.twig. And close. Start the page one to seven dot zero point zero point one eight ten thousand. And uh, this happens after you go to the command and go to one to seven and you hit this command plus So here we go, got a result, this is my first page, so I just, you just need to hit this command, hp-s, into 7, in the project folder, and then you will see this is my first page. So we have created our first page. So, um, thank you for watching this video, if you like this video, please. Uh, like, comment, share and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.